The average person eats a stone and a half of chocolate every year, and on this special break, every course of every meal contains chocolate, even breakfast. It's sort of like the opposite to a trip to a health farm, and it's right here in the heart of the Cotswolds. The Cotswolds are north of London, south of Birmingham, and right in the middle of Middle England. The top of Broadway Tower in the Vale of Esham is the perfect place to get your bearings. I'm going to show you the countryside because the Cotswolds has to be one of the most beautiful places I've ever been to in England. I mean, just look at that. This Mother's Day, you could give your man more than just a box of chocolates. In the village of Miggleton, the Three Ways House Hotel is home to the Chocoholics experience. A short break that's long on calories. You can even book a room named after your favourite pudding. And there was only one for me. So this is a sticky toffee and date pudding themed room. So come in, come in. Now, it's done out like a Bedouin tent, but it's very clever because this is not material. It's just been painted onto walls. And I have got a nice little man at the side holding up the recipe for sticky toffee and date pudding. So you can make that when you're in bed. Five minutes down the road from Mickleton is Chip and Camden. I popped into the volunteer at Pub in the High Street for an aperitif. This is a pint of locally brewed Cotswold Ware, and it's named after a walking trail which goes all the way from here in Chipping Camden to Bath, which is 106 miles away. So you would need a few of these on the way there. Back at the hotel, and time for a few sweet nothings from Mark the chef. We're making a, a white chocolate sauce to go with our asparagus for a starter tonight. Right, asparagus and white, white chocolate. chocolate sauce. Um, this is a little unusual. Very unusual, yeah. Does it taste all right? It tastes wonderful, yeah. You sure? No, until you've tried it. Now, um, is there anywhere you wouldn't go with chocolate? What do you mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, is there anything you wouldn't cook with chocolate? Mm, no, I think I'd try anything, really. Yeah? yeah. And when he says anything, he means it. Chicken and dark chocolate sauce or asparagus and white chocolate sauce. First off, you just taste the chocolate. It's quite sweet. But then when you get more of the asparagus, it works very nicely. As my fellow chocoholics tucked into their main courses, I went off to investigate another of the hotel's attractions, the Pudding Club. You don't have to be a member to take Ladies part. and gentlemen, please prepare yourself for the bit you've all been waiting for. It's the Pudding Parade, ladies and gentlemen. This is a twice-monthly feast where over 70 club members attempt to scoff seven desserts each. I opted for the squidgy chocolate and nut with extra chocolate sauce. I've finished the first one. <laughs> But there's more to the Cotswolds than puddings and chocolate. If you want to give your mam extra treats, here's how you can push the boat out. 30 minutes away, explore your sense of sense at the perfumery in Victoria Street in Borton on the Water. And just 20 minutes from Mickleton is Stratford upon Avon Racecourse. A great day out for your man and your dad. Now, it is the biggest race meeting of the year and here Kalu today. And if you get here early enough, these stands are free, so you get a very good view three, of the, the races. races. This is my first race meeting, and I do have five whole pounds to put on a horse. I need to get some advice because I don't have a clue what I'm yeah. doing. Mr. Dow Jones, uh, good pedigree, sniffing him down the track, smells good on the way past. Did you sniff him? Yeah. Oh, you didn't sniff him? Yeah. Yeah, that's how you tell. Is it? Yeah. And with a tip like that, my decision was made. Can I have number nine, please? Five pounds to win. Number nine, 25 to one, five pound win. If you give me another pound, you can take the horse home with you. <laughs> £130! I could have had 
another pudding without fibre. The cards walls are much more beautiful than I thought they were going to be. Little chocolate box villages. Your man would love it down here. It's quiet, it's peaceful. And if she's got a sweet tooth, then this is the perfect place to bring her because the puddings are fantastic.